Also this hour, French President Emmanuel Macron met Saudi Arabia's Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman Al Saud at the Elysee Presidential Palace in Paris. Among other things, he, the meeting called for an end to the political vacuum in Lebanon. The call comes after Lebanese lawmakers on Wednesday failed for a 12th time to elect a new president. After the meeting, the French presidency even pointed out that the absence of a president in Lebanon remains a major obstacle to resolving the country's severe socio-economic crises. The meeting comes after dozens of depositors stormed several banks in Lebanon's capital Beirut seeking rights to withdraw their savings. Protesters vandalized several banks over unpopular policies amid the ongoing financial crisis in the country. The depositors went from bank to bank in one Beirut neighborhood, burning tires and breaking windows. The depositors outcry, a depositor protest group, organized the protests. Kill or be killed. Those who took your money, take their money. We have nothing to lose anymore. Four years and we are done with them. We waited too long. It's enough. We are going to get our rights with blood for them. It's getting expensive and has gotten to a point when the depositors can't even get medicine. He cannot put his children in school. He cannot take care of his children. He cannot live with dignity. You give him the dollar at 15,000 and he worked for 30 or 40 years. What do you expect is going to happen? This protest is very little. It's going to get worse. No one is going to stay silent. They still don't understand that they need to give us some money back. <laughs> Similar protests were also witnessed last year. The financial crisis in Lebanon began in 2019. Since the onset of the crisis, Lebanon's cash-strapped banks have imposed informal limits on cash withdrawals, trapping millions of people's life savings. The Lebanese pound has lost 90% of its value against the US dollar since late 2019. This has made it difficult for millions across the country to cope with skyrocketing prices while inflation spirals in the country. We On is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.